all, Shafi Nicole here, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can add your appointments or anything that's on your schedule to your calendar app, and I'm going to show you how to add it to your Google Calendar. Now, first off, I have nothing on this <laughs> calendar for appointments, but I do actually have an appointment tomorrow, so I'm going to go ahead and put that in here just to show you how to do it. Okay, so I have a chiropractor's appointment tomorrow at 11 o'clock. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to create a split screen. And then I'm going to use my Apple Calendar. Now what you have to do is you need to tap on the day. Then I'm going to take my lasso tool and I'm going to lasso around that chiropractor at 8 at 11 a.m. and then I'm going to drag it over here like this and you see the plus sign comes up and then I'm just gonna drag it down to my time which is 11 I probably did that because I have it All right, so let me do that All right now I'm going to lasso around it and then I'm gonna drag it over to 11 and make sure it's upright this way because if you do make it diagonal it's gonna come up really funky so make sure it's like this and then if you want you can um, put it back like that so now I'm going to show you how to add it with the Google Calendar so again I'm going to create a split screen and then I'm going to find my Google Calendar Okay. So now I'm going to have my Google Calendar open. So with Google Calendar, you have to like swipe over like so to get to your day. And again, I'm just going to make this right side up just in case. Now with Google Calendar, it's a little different. Like you can't just, like you did with Apple Calendar, just lasso around and drag it over. This one works a little differently. So you're going to have to click on the plus sign right here and then we're going to add an event. Now we're going to take this and we're going to pop it over and then there's your plus sign right at the top there. There we go. And then there it is. Chiropractor at 11. And then whatever you need to do right here, you would just add it or change it and then just tap save. And there you have it right there. Okay. okay. And that's it. It's super simple, super easy. If you have questions, please put them in the comment section or you can message me on Etsy. So if you found this video to be helpful, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And until next time, bye y'all.